Welcome to another edition of the Nightly News. And of course, here it's the uh, Friday free for all. But of course, in the Biden administration right now, Ted, it's the free fall. <laughs> it's just honestly, he's right now holding his own little press conference and it's called free fall. I don't know if you saw. Well, I know you see everything, Ted. In Kamala Harris's staff, she's lost another six or seven people. They just resigned because they can't either deal with her, put up with the nonsense or all the above. Of course, uh, the press secretary, Jen Psaki, um, she's leaving to go to MSNBC, which is obviously kind of a, a lateral transfer. Go from one job where you're paid to lie all day to another job where you get paid to lie all day. I don't know. What do you got today for me on our free for all, my friend? Well, all of the above is glaringly obvious. And Keith, I give you Cockroach Spotlighter of the Year Award once again. <laughs> because really what the Nightly Nuge is, it doesn't just represent Keith, Mark, and Ted Nuge and our families, even though it does accurately. It represents the heart and soul, a pulse of goodwill and decency. You got a tour coming up. You got a new album coming out um, April 29. You're going to be down in Florida, Kid Rock. It's going to coincide with the new album coming out. How excited are you, buddy? You know, I love my music. I've been doing this since I was like eight years old. I've been recording since I was like uh, 16 years old from the Amboy Duo, the, the Royal High Boys in 58, the Lourdes in 1960, the Amboy Dukes in 1965, the Ted Nugent Band from 74 on, Damn Yankees, uh, 89 through 93, um, and jamming with the greatest musicians, Greg Smith on bass guitar, Greg Smith. On bass mm. guitar, the guy's an animal. The guy is some strange creature of rhythm and throb. And Jason Hartless from Detroit on drums. Jason Hartless, Greg Smith are my rhythm section. My mm -hmm. music has a life of its own because of these guys. And Detroit Muscle was like an orgy of rhythm and blues and rock and roll, middle fingers on fire. James Brown would dance to my new record. <laughs> Little Richard would scream and jump up on his piano and light it on fire if he heard Detroit Muscle from Ted Nugent 2022. So we're very happy. We are headlining a big beach bash in Panama City down there in Florida on April 29th. And the next night, Kid Rock is headlining. I think Panama City is making a statement that has some political ramifications when they hire Ted Nugent and Kid Rock. So ultimately, all I can tell you is that I'm an old man. You can tell by the silver beard. I'm almost auditioning for Santa Claus 22, but my spirit is fully erect. It has a titillating essence to my rhythm and blues cravings. And when Greg and Jason and I hit the stage in Panama City on the 29th and start the tour in July, God help us all because my guitar does not gently weep. And when we unleash Ted Nugent music straight from the heart and soul and, and crotch of the Motor City, the rut will start early this year if herbivores hear my guitar. <laughs> so I, 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 you know, I'm an old man, but I, I'm so cocked, locked, and ready to rock the Glock around the clock, Dr. Spock, that I thank God every day for my enthusiasm and my passion. And once again, when I'm surrounded by my incredible crew, Linda and Doug and my family, and the incredible Jason and Greg rhythm section, I'm like a 10-year-old guitar craver with his first loud amp in a Detroit garage. I'm a lucky, lucky man to have those passions. But let me articulate once again and emphasize, I've been clean and sober my whole life. Things work better when you're clean and sober, and it's never too late to get clean and sober. And if you think you're party, if you think you're having a party so far, when you're clean and sober is when the real party ignites. So thank you everybody for supporting my rhythm and blues, rock and roll, Detroit grinding career all these years. You know, I've been doing this now, Keith, for over 65 years. Wow. And I, I'm more excited about this year's tour in the new Detroit Muscle record than I've ever been. And that's because I'm connected to God's miraculous creation with my Matthews bow and my, my new Rite shotgun and Happy Sadie and Coco so that down-to-earth, grounded, hunting, fishing, trapping, conservation, environmental stewardship lifestyle comes out of my guitar. And I don't know how this amp sounds on Nightning Nude, but just think, I will play a lick that I've never played before. <laughs> Thank you. 
there's a gut pile in the not so distant history where that lit comes from. So thank you everybody for sort of supporting my musical dreams and thank you everybody. I look forward to seeing you on the uh, Detroit Muscle Tour 2022. I will cleanse your soul. Check out tednugent.com, tednugent.com. You can get the new music, you can get the old music, you can get swag, signed hats, signed flags. I mean, it is a smorgasbord of Ted Nugent items. Go to tednugent.com and check it all out. We'll see you tomorrow on a weekend edition of The Nightly Nuge. Mm -hmm.